Will the Machacho Man ever make it to the big time? Will Brink Logan ever get away from the scripts? Will Stag Logan actually finish a pizza? We'll find out in WrestleQuest! Ooh, yeah! Welcome back to WrestleQuest! Previously, we had more tutorial, but with Brink Logan this time. We were talking about, um, you know, walk-ons and hype types. And we had our first scripted match against the Hig Boys. It didn't go in our favor, sadly. But we're gonna go home and have a nice warm cup of maple tea, because this is the Great White North. Actually, the, I, I read there is a chest around here in this northern section by Logan's house. We gotta steal somebody's Christmas presents. I wanna steal the Christmas presents real quick. It's gotta be one of these houses. Like, how about this one? Yep, there it is. The last chest. Slam shakes. Those will help with AP at least. How much how much uh, slam bucks do we make for that? 1,000. Not bad. We made some slam bucks on that, uh, throwing that match a little bit. That was definitely a thrown match. That was bogus. That one a Hig Boy just hulked us right out of the ring. It's like, it's like everything is fake in wrestling or something. This is the Logan residence. It's not just Brink Logan that lives here, but, uh, you know, they do quite well. They do quite well. What are they doing here? What is this? I like it. They got, like, their own little short order restaurant. They love to fry things here. Just fridges filled with turkeys. So many. Jeez. How many turkeys do we need to deep fry at once? Are they even turkeys? Or are they just like sacks of things? Maybe they make poutine. It is the Great White North. But I didn't see any mayonnaise in there. This is Paul Logan's office. He's got some awards. Like uh, sitting down and throwing the horns. He was the best at it. He's got the requ requisite Canada cacti. No, I don't think I checked this room. Ah, yes, our own personal wrestling ring! You don't need to go to the gym. I mean, heck, when you're modeled like this, do you really need to go to the gym? I don't think so. I don't think so. Those Hick boys really get to me. Such baby faces in the ring, but they're total jagoffs out of it. I can't believe they would say that on this cute kids game, made for kids. Involving wrestling that is totally real. Someday. Someday. I just know that I put my time in, pay my dues, and earn my stripes. Greatness will come my way. I love how he, he sleeps next to a suitcase that has a silencer in it, if there was one. A silenced pistol, that is. You know what? This guy kind of reminds me of that other game that I played, um, the, the Fashion Police Squad. He kind of reminds me of uh, Uwu Senpai Sephiroth, whatever his name was, with the glasses. And when it does, I'll put it in a submission leg lock. Back to the Macho Man, the Muchacho Man, not the Macho Man. The Macho Man is right there. Oh yeah. Actually, we could we could switch the camera. Oh yeah. You can do that. You could look around the world map without needing to move. I wonder how far it goes. Wow, oh, it, it goes pretty far actually. There's another mu There's another Macho. Is it nothing but Macho statues? I don't even know what this stuff's all about. I haven't gotten here. There's the P.A.W. Okay, that, that feels like a final continent situation going on over there. We got Junglaji 
Jake the there you go, and Jake the Snake Roberts got a statue. Worshipping Cthulhu or something. We got the the, the the nether portal to uh the that one World of Warcraft expansion. We just go into that and we'll fight some Torin. Or with Torin ancestors. I d I don't even remember. Speaking of Torin, what are the size of these houses? Holy crap! Do we got giant wrestlers? Maybe looking at this world map is a spoiler. But I want to see what other interesting locales are in our future. I wish the camera would move a little bit faster. We're back to the future now. Maybe some kind of ancient wrestling... thing. Ancient wrestling civilization. An ice cream land? The cream factory! Ooh, yeah! That's where I get to the top of the cream crop. I cream on the crop. Jeff Jarrett? Okay, that's enough looking. That's enough looking! Don't be spoiling everything in the video game. We're going to Boxwood! We can also go to the back Raider Breaker Boneyard. You know what? I haven't looked at this statue. I didn't even know it was there behind the BEW sign. It's another wrestler statue, ain't it? Hello. I always wanted to be a superhero. But being a pro wrestler is even better. The spectacle in the ring is better than anything in the comic books. Check out one of JYD's matches. You'll see what I mean. JYD? I, I'm not too familiar with that acronym. Oh, Junkyard Dog. You know what? I'm not familiar with him. He must have been be an even older wrestler. Junkyard Dog was the first black wrestler to climb to the pinnacle of his promotion. Prior to crushing foes and winning fans as a pro wrestler, he was doing both on the football field. Believed by his fans and feared by competitors, Junkyard Dog would end matches with his thump, an earth-shaking power slam. Yeah, I, I know, I, re I remember nothing about Junkyard Dog. Maybe he's one of those, like, special wrestlers who could get, like those managers. Junkyard Dog was the best. If he knew what the Hubcap Gang w was up to in his junkyard, they'd be running scared. Maybe we could find him and help him do something about that. But yeah, I draw a blank on the Junkyard Dog. I thought we would be blocked off from this area. Um, there's an, there's an area around here that has some more of those influencers. Yeah, you know what? We'll check it out now. Sandblast Pete's. I see some references already. These Wrestle Raiders make me sick. Yelling and screaming about the sand. Bound to those weakling road warriors. Mark my words, the day will come when the Warlord will show the Wasteland that the strongest wrestler of the toy room really is. Okay, you work on that. Deal is that I won't kill you. I reckon that's a bargain, ain't it? Wow, sorry. I thought you were more raiders, not customers. Please have a look. I got some money. What you got? Um, armor rating of eight. And not much else. A recipe for a fury band. I could afford it. Even though I still haven't unlocked uh, crafting yet, I'm hoping it's soon. But every re every uh, recipe is a help. I'm familiar with these two guys, though. And if you watched Vine Sauce, you'll be referenced. You'll be interested too. But they're here. The here the is. Ooh, you don't think Joel has got it, huh? Think the sauciest streamer doesn't have what it takes to be in the danger zone, huh? Better believe when Vine Wrestle stops on you, Vinny. Bones are gonna be breaking, your booties will be shaking, and man, when friend, friend flexes you, the spaghetti sauce powers will explode at Vine Wrestle. Vine Sauce, as a group, 
they have this vine wrestle thing every year where they're they and their memes that they've created like wrestle in uh what is it um wrestle the the, the wrestling game 2019 wrestlemania 2019 wwf 20 it's 2019 i remember that much where you can make your own custom wrestlers it's kind of a, a traditional thing for a few years now Drink some milk for your skeleton. Take some supplements and me. I'll make you home bell. Cause Joel said so. And as Bulk would have said it, oh yes, the muscles. Oh yeah, he's got a meme called Bulk Bogan. I remember that part. And that's his mascot or whatever. He's Swedish. You hear what they said about me? Oh well. At least we can see the Road Warrior statues later. Yeah! Ah, I gotta try that better. <laughs> no, that's goo. Sorry. Yeah! Ah, I can't do it! My throat won't do it today. It's too much Randy Savage, but yeah. Yeah! <sighs> I watch this guy too much. I know at least one other person that watches Vinny as well. I'm not alone in here. They'd be pointing at the screen going, I understood that reference, and you did a terrible meet. Anyway. Boxwood. Yes, Vinny did get a gift set from WrestleQuest. No, he never played WrestleQuest. He doesn't intend to. Boxwood. A rough town, but wrestling is popular here. I should find a place to stay. While I fight to become the BEW Championship title holder. I'm ready! Something spicy is gonna happen here, I can just feel it. Yo! I, I can't do it, I can't get the rattle. It's gonna drive me nuts. I, I, would, I used to be able to do it. One time. Help, arm robbery! Arm robbery! Shut him up. Try to take his lips. Come on, man, I just got these parts. Hey, you better leave him alone, or muchacho man is gonna show you what happens to two bit thugs and miscreants. Ooh, see ya. Wow, a tough guy, eh? How'd a guy wearing a blanket get so tough? This ain't a blanket, it's. doesn't matter. Well, use it as your body bag in a moment. Get him! You don't look like wrestlers to me. That means you won't go down for the count unless I make you go down. Stunner style! Yeah, these plushies are going down. They don't even need to be pinned. They're just going down. Nice fighting, loser. This is why I'm doing Technician, so I can get a height plus six every time I hit a button. Problem solved! And some metal chains that I can't use. Come on, let's beat it! Better enjoy that blanket while you can, tough guy. It's not a blanket! <laughs> Culturally insensitive. Are you okay? Mansus, I was about to bust those soft plastic knockoffs. I don't need any help. What? I saved you. Without Mucho Man, Muchacho Man, you would have been meshed. Look, tough guy. I don't need saving around here, come prende. We can take care of ourselves. What a mean potato man. So what are you supposed to be? Some kind of wannabe hero? What? I'm the toughest. I'm the savagest. I'm the... Listen, you seem new around here, so let me give you some advice. Keep your dumb cape and stupid shades out of other people's business. Who's just trying to help? Yes, her name was Barbe. And that must be Ken in the corner. 
It's getting late. I should find a place to bed down for the night. I don't know if I trust any of the hotels around here. It's okay. Nobody said the world to pro wrestling glory would be comfortable. I bet I could find a nice spot if I checked that sign. Our first slam in the real world. Well, what about those cultists? They seem pretty real. BEW wrestling is tough, just like our town. Display Stan Dane, his name is. He's built like one. This here's my street corner. You want a place to work or sleep? Go try to park. Oh, great. Another Wessler wannabe. Beat it. Why are the children's toys so... They're like the Babby toys. The Babby toys are so rude. Backbreaker Boneyard is east of this town. Don't go there, though. That's Hopcap Gang territory. Also, I got an achievement for talking to people. Car shop? Eh, nobody home. Not even a chest to loot. Rude. Oh, hello. I love Lethal Wedding. This game is sick. Lethal Wedding. That's when friendship in Mortal Kombat goes to the next level. Wrestle Raiders roam the deserts to the north. They worship the Road Warriors, scouring the sands for face paint. Also, there's a weirdo named Joel and Vinny out there. They keep on going, yow! Ah! Yow! There we go! I got it! I needed. I needed some phlegm, that's all I needed. I'm working on my rhymes! What can I do with clockwork? Eh. Wing Knight. Your name is Wing Knight. That makes me upset. So, where can we sleep? There's a basketball court. There's two basketball courts. There's a 213. That must be a gym. Home of Boxwood Extreme Wrestling. EEW. Aha. Uh -huh. I bet a bench in the park would be just as nice as the floor back in the training gym. Did you bring your sleeping bag at least there, Randy? I mean, muchacho man. Muchacho. The path is blocked like crazed and unwashed fans on the entrance ramp. Better come back later, amigo. That'll keep us from exploring the town. It's no ants block your way. Please don't step on them, but it's the next best thing. I knew you'd be using that blanket tonight, tough guy. Too bad it isn't bulletproof, though. Mr. Lobster Bib Guy? This is the last time I'm gonna say this. Yes, it is. Get him, boys! Whoa! Vehicular slaughter! This dude? The one in the survive? Is that what that is? Finally! What did I tell you about coming into my turf chuck chain? We got no beef with you, Toy Box. We're after this out of towner. Really? Earlier today, you were here after my little cousin. Cousin? I gotta say, I don't see the family resemblance. Family is a funny thing, boss. Ask your sister what I mean. Oh! You just jimmied your last joke, Jimmy. We got a friend! And we could tag team! Muchacho Man doesn't have to fight alone. Use powerful tag team gimmicks to turn the tide of battle. Prepare for a tag team with one character and then use the right hour to pick tag team. Every combination has different abilities. It's dual tax. It's dual tax. And eventually triple tax. So. I'm not going to waste the AP with this. I don't think these characters actually carry anything for tutorial purposes. But it's a steal. Toy Box Jimmy can steal. Can I get Tag it? team! You sure can, Jimmy! Lunchbox Jimmy! Say goodnight. Eat the taco! Eat the taco, eat it. Oh yeah. 
think we might be able to do burning damage with that. I think it might be random or I'm hallucinating. I'm not quite sure which. Let's try it again. More tacos. It's the only AOE we got. Nah, I don't think it really explodes in fire. I think I really was hallucinating. Also, Jimmy is making, like, no hype right now. Because he doesn't have a hype type. Chop him up. I do like the voice actor for Jimmy. Well, at least he can regenerate AP now. This rats is tough. Luckily, we have healing items. Uh, we'll use the tape. Regular tape. The toys, you just tape them up and they feel better. They have no bones. Certainly not these rats. They're either made out of plastic or flesh. I'm not quite sure which. I kind of hoping that I would get a level for Jimmy, but that's okay. He starts at level 1, which is dangerous. We got the Grande Splash, though. That is a hype maneuver. You need to have certain levels of hype to even use it. But it's an AoE. Thanks, guys, muchacho man, who's you big time? Consider us even. My little cousin here says you saved his skin earlier. Sorry for how I acted before. Jimmy said we need to take care of our own. Cousins! Hey, in Boxwood, we don't have friends. Only family. So don't worry about appearances. Well, in that case, you got a couch for a brother to catch uh, the crash on. Haha, <laughs> my manses. You can sleep in style tonight. Follow me. We slammed them with a car. At least half of them. They'll be okay. Wow, you got a pet raptor! Hey man, do you always sleep this heavy after a fight? You better invest in pillows then if you're gonna stay in Boxwood. No way! I was just enjoying the softness of these plastic sheets. You must not have been expecting company. Yeah, sorry about that. The, the boys get a little greasy here. Can't have them staying in the cushions, you know? But at least you have your own blanket. <laughs> Psych. I know that's not a blanket. Anyways, I'm glad you're awake. Now we can get going. Going where? Around town, Holmes. Look, last thing I want for you is to get in another gang's bad side. You understand? Life in the box. Everybody lives in the box, but we got Toy Box Jimmy. So it can't all be that bad. This here is the uh, market district. You got your guns and your groceries. Everything you need to survive in the box. Then the north is the school. The south is some homes and the local gym. Then the west is the hospital. Head there if you need some healing, duh. You can always buy some tape too. If you exit town and go to the east, you'll hit the back breaker boneyard. Best stay away from there, though, Holmes. And why is that, hombre? That junkyard is the hubcap gang's turf. Those thugs that you met last night, we have an uneasy alliance. No beef as long as they don't mess with my shop or my crew. Speaking of which, let's see if you can get you hooked up for something that packs a bit more punch. Finally, some new weapons. Welcome to Refuel and Reload. Your one-stop shop for what keeps you going. Bullets and gas. Hey there, TBJ. Who's the stranger? I love your head. This here's Muchacho Man, a real tough guy. He already threw down with the Hubcap Gang. Wow. Came here to get him outfitted with something more powerful. It's a cinch. I got all kinds of stuff to keep you locked and loaded. 
It's got the karate chopper, but the hammer fist is better in pretty much every way for the same price. It's a uh, weapon rating 25, knockback chance increased by 10. Oh, I don't. I got the money. F I don't got the money for it. Uh oh. No any place where I could get some cash. I just want to have more money than that. What I spend it on? Yeah, I really want to get that hammer fist as soon as possible. There's also boots and the speedos will give armor rating. Utility belt is actually pretty useful and gives more armor rating. Gives you the smoke bomb gimmick. But it says on the tin. Hood blinkers for speed. Um, you know what? I haven't read anything about why what makes soft more resistant to compared to hard or plush. But the plush gives you charisma at least. But you have garbage defenses. These are useful because they give you charisma and AP. They're like an upgraded version of the el elbow pad. That's pretty much like the only thing I can buy is elbow pads. Jeez. Or a cape for power. You know what? Muchacho Man's going to be a hero. Wear a cape. Go ahead. So you are some kind of stunt man in your old town? Stunt men! No stunts here, companero. I'm a hundred percent all real wrestler. Wrestling? My man, you're in the right place. Big time fan of wrestling. Amigo, Boxwood would explode if I entered the ring. This town can't hold me. This dimension can't even hold me. Jimmy, I'm going to be the greatest wrestler of all time. Heh. <laughs> You might have arrived to town just the right moment. You talking about the Pa Dot match? Because apparently, co comparatively speaking, everything else is just a cup of coffee. I know the local wrestling organization, BEW, is going to make sure that their best wrestler ends up in the match. I must therefore become their best wrestler. Oh, see ya. Hold up a sec. Why don't you get a little taste of the local color before you bite off more than you can chew? Speak plainly, Jimmy. No riddles. Just give it muchacho man straight. Come on. There's always some amateurs looking to slam at the gym. You could cut your teeth on him. So we're going to have to fight some amateur mat junkies. But probably next time. Status effects. Wear stuff? Don't get them. Like that uh, ring in there will keep you from getting demotivated, which reduces your attack power. Do I need to heal up? No, not really. What I need to do is find a way to get money. Man, would you believe my insurance would cover feather extensions? Suplex impact absorber, sure, but not feather extensions. I would like- I want a raptor on the team. Where, where, where can we get a wrestling raptor? Because I, I want him. There's so many of them. Man, I was gonna check this car, but my arms are too short. I have a big head and tiny arms. I can't steal a car. They said it would be a liability in the ring, but if you ask me, nothing looks better than to keep streaming through the air doing a high fly move. Sweet. <laughs> That's why I bought one, compadre. You can go in some of these apartments. I think there's a treasure chest in one of them. Ah, oh, Raptor's running a drugstore. They're learning. Sorry, boys, for fresh out of coca drops. Well, he has a kung fu grip hand for a thousand, but I don't have the money. Man, it's not like a craft anyway. I just got these Lu Ton high heels for my in-ring personality. No cough. Uh, no quaff? Is that how you're supposed to say it? She'll kick your eye out. I kind of like her other name. Lucha Dora Clicksamora. Because why not? 
I don't even know what that's supposed to be. Is that OnlyFans? Nice push, robot. Hey there, sugar. You're looking for some human-cyborg relations? Technically, I'm not a human. And technically, you're not a cyborg. Muchacho, man. You're not going to get anything at that rate. No, fam, man. How are we supposed to play shirts and the first skin if I can't even take my shirt off? I don't even have a shirt, so I'm skins by default. Looks like you forfeit, player. Forget this. I'm going to go practice my suplexes. That is a better use of your time. Practice the suplexes. You'll need them in the ring. I know there's an apartment around here. Maybe it's a, down towards the gym. Maybe it is an apartment I missed here. There's a raptor at the car shop. I'll talk to him. Hey man, you sleep okay? See. For a broken down couch in an illegal chop shop, it was great. Heh. <laughs> No place like home, right? Comfort like this? Why leave? Why leave indeed? What a great place to live and do things in. All the time. With the garbage everywhere. Oh, okay, this might be the apartment. No. No, just somebody's house. Hi. I'm a protagonist now. Pepperoni rolls are almost done. The neighbor kid, the neighborhood kids need them for strength, so they can practice their super kicks. Her name's just Deborah. She really is a Barbie. Yeah, the apartment must be somewhere else then. Once I see that treasure chest meter, I need to have all the treasure. I need to have all the treasure. You can't tempt me like that and not give me the treasure. I will find where you live, and then I'll take your treasure chest out of it. There's one right there, actually. Sturdiness boost. That's more HP. I might want to hold on to the boosts until I really need them. Okay, no. Pretty sure I tried all of these. They might be by the school, and we can't go there yet. I think. We'll go down this way, just to make sure. Commercial district, I'm guessing. We're gonna nastidize these soft, soft plastic wannabes around here. You kind of look like um, that dude that did Gangnam Sky style, I'm just saying. Also, these are the nasty boys. I remember them. Boxwood to BEW sure do love extreme hardcore wrestling. Why are they ready to get nasty? I don't know. Uh, that one robot is, though. Oh, okay, here's the house. Juice store special. This is not the house I was looking for, but I could use that later. Need a juice recommendation? I suggest Super Kick. Two parts orange juice, one part crushed jalapeno, five parts tomato juice. Garnish with fruit flavored cereal. What? I don't want a crunchy juice. Also, that weapon we picked up is not for us. I can't use it. Our muchacho man can't use it. Jimmy can't use it. It's for a character we'll find later. And it's quite useful because it does demotivate. You just squirt somebody and they get demotivated. With juice. Okay, I'm not quite sure which apartment it is. It must be in the school section, but... I don't want to continue anymore with story. Because we're already past the half hour mark. So, next time on WrestleQuest, we're gonna mess up some punks to prove that we're the, the best at messing up punks and also BEW. And we also need some cash. We need a cash flow of some sort. Jeez. Good night, everybody.